But after missing a chance to feature in the breakdancing event at next year's Olympics, Tanzania is looking to field competitors at the 2028 Games. CDTN's Daniel Kijo now reports on this genre of dance, which has been chosen to feature in the 2024 Paris Olympic program as a new sport. Acrobatic movements and fancy footwork match to a beat. Now considered athletes, these breakdancers are hoping to one day make it to the Olympics. Last year's East African breakdancing champion, Amadeus Amadeus, is one of the hopefuls. In the past, we would break dance, but it was perceived as just a street thing. And if you went to authorities to explain what you're doing, they wouldn't understand. But with the Olympics now recognizing it as a sport, we can approach the local authorities and get opportunities. This center sees up to 50 breakdancers attend practice session every week. Many of them see breakdancing as more than just a sport. My expectation is that this becomes a job for me. I believe I'll get to an age where I can't break dance anymore. But as a source of employment, I would like to pass this knowledge on to others. Without official recognition locally, Tanzania missed its chance to qualify for the 2024 Olympics. However, the Tanzanian Olympic Committee has now included breakdancing as one of the six sports it will take to the 2028 Games, including athletics, women's football, swimming, amateur boxing, and judo. Breaking first debuted at the 2018 Youth Olympic Games in Buenos Aires. Because of his success there, Breaking has been selected to feature in the 2024 Paris Olympic Sports Program as a new sport. Tanzania hopes that by 2028, it too can send representatives for the sports to the Olympics. Despite their zeal and recent government backing, Tanzanian breakers still face a number of hurdles. We are struggling to get women involved in breaking. It's been very hard. There are some girls we have started training, but there are still challenges at the family level that are keeping them from the sport. What started as a pastime has now turned into a means of recognition and potentially a source of income for young people in the country. Breakers in Tanzania are hoping that with great beats and some hard work, they can one day dance their way to Olympic glory. Daniel Kijo, CGTN, Dar es Salaam.